Alright, let's see if I uh, actually get any f audio. <sighs> Hello, all. D Swank here. And, um, I've got a handful of ships that I'm putting up on the workshop. Uh, uh, they're already up on the workshop. I put them up before I recorded this. But as these videos are released. I'll link back to them from the workshop, but these will have the links to the ships in them. First off, we're going to take a look at the original Ship of Fools. Now, way back, way back, uh, shortly after the planets were first introduced to space engineers, and Fuzz and I had just started our co-op series. I appeared on Fuzz's save, his dead leads had crashed, uh, things were not going particularly well, and we thought, let's go to space, maybe the game will behave better, and we ended up building Helheim, which is still one of our favorite bases. Now, this is, if I just paste in the, the most recent save of the ship I have here... There's only like a handful of mods in this world. They're um, weapon mods. Um, so we don't actually get most of the blocks that were on this ship that are missing. We had over here some modded beds, which I'll turn the lights on. And we had the ore detector here we had azimuth cargo containers here here and here we had a modular solar array uh, set up that covered the top of this because it's three wide and then from battle cannons and more we had Beauforce on the side. But other than that, this is pretty much vanilla Ship of Fools. So what I have done is I came over here and well, I added the proper landing gear on. Put in the vanilla ore detector put solar panels down the length and armored panels beside that. Replace the azimuth containers with vanilla cargo. Did I put any... D oh yeah, I did put some DLC because I believe the armor panels are DLC. Um, let's see. Came through here. I don't have the gravity generator on. We're inside. And yeah, I put the beds in. So technically this has some DLC blocks in it. But this is as close as we can get to the original Ship of Fools. As was originally built. And it is now up on the workshop. That way you can see what the original looked like as we get to finishing the Ship of Fools Mark II, or the Modernized, or whatever you wish to call it, the Fool's Fallacy, in our current survival scenario. So, I hope you've enjoyed this quick tour of the ship. I hope you enjoy playing around with her on your own world, and... I will see you next time where I've got two more ships that are up on the workshop that I'm spotlighting. Uh, next is going to be the lifter from the survival series. And after that is that big thing that you've seen popping in the background a little bit, which is a vanilla or vanilla like the DLC included rebuild of the Sisyphus.
So, until tomorrow, bye bye